So literally, as I'm signing off from you guys to say goodnight, an $8 tip comes in. I don't know if you can see it. An $8 tip comes in. So my total right now is What's up, riders? I actually just got in my car. I turned my app on in my apartment while I was just handling some things personally. Normally, that's how I start my day. I normally just turn the app on when I'm in the apartment, and if I get a hit, I'll, um, you know, get on the road. But the past couple of days, when you guys have been seeing my videos, I actually had, like, errands to run, so I've been starting them, you know, in my car. But the first hit I got, we're going to McDonald's. So, uh, let's go ahead and head over there. Oh, and by the way, get used to me wearing this shirt. <laughs> it's like my uniform, because I wear it a lot. But enough about that, let's go. Give me one second. Do you have an Uber or what is it? It's Uber. Okay, can you tell me the code? 51F74. Thank you. Looks like we got a lot of drinks. Three Sprites and two Cokes. Mercy, mercy me. Start day one. Oh, two minutes away. I just dropped my first order off to Angel, first order of the day, and I'm actually gonna pull over here so I can wait for my next order, but also wanna show you guys the map, show you what's exactly going on today because today could be a really good day, tomorrow too. I just pulled over under a nice little shade tree. So um, I think I'm gonna do, today is Tuesday and tomorrow is Wednesday it should be and i think i'm gonna do today and tomorrow just combine into one video the reason why i want to do this one is because i want to see how much we can make in two days with the promotion that's going on let me show you so we're gonna click on my face we're gonna go to earnings and promotions so today like you've seen in some of our other videos they brought this back six dollars extra by completing three trips day one of two so for the next two days they're going to be running this promotion and what's interesting is un until 8 a.m so tomorrow 8 a.m is when it stops so if we just keep running through the rest of the night we might actually be able to get a good chunk of money i mean i normally stop about 11 12 depending on what time i get out today I actually got out a little earlier than i normally do I think I got out at like 12 something. It's 115 right now. So yeah, um, we have the potential to make a few extra dollars on top of what we're normally doing. Plus, the boost right now isn't much and it's not even in my area. But later tonight, let's see. Dun, dun, dun. Yep, it's uh, we got some pretty good things going on. So... We should be able to do pretty well tonight. Actually, my area, big old goose egg, nothing's down here. But that doesn't mean I'm going to be staying down here. It'll pull me all over. So, ride along with me for the next two days. Let me add this to my uh, trip. And we'll see how much we do Tuesday and Wednesday. Let's go. A few things I have to get done before we can go. Uh, I gotta get some gas and uh, my stomach started to growl so I definitely need to get some food. Um, I think I'm just gonna get some fries from Jack in the Box. I had a, um, a carrot smoothie. It was carrot, I know it sounds kind of weird, but it was carrot, sweet potato pot, sweet potato, <laughs> sweet potato pot. Carrot, sweet potato, and uh, orange grapefruit and pineapple all mixed together in a um, in a juice and then I had some frozen pineapples that I blended it together to turn it into a smoothie so I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier in the morning because I know while I'm out here doing these runs I'm normally just grabbing whatever I can so if I'm gonna do that I'm at least gonna try to just keep it small so I'm about to get some gas I'm actually gonna turn this app off because I don't want to not be able to accept an order and then have my acceptance rates all crazy so i'm gonna get some gas get some fries and then we're gonna be back online
promise. All right, guys, I'm showing you, I just pulled in to get some gas. I'm gonna show you this app, it's called um, Get Upside. Uh, a lot of these other little gig apps on my phone, I'm actually gonna probably go into those into another video. But um, I actually just started using this maybe like three weeks ago. And as you can see, I've already racked up $2.45, which might not seem like a lot, but anything you can get as far as like, um some money back when getting this gas especially me because i have a jeep it helps so i just pulled into here it found my location and it asked you do you want to get the offer it looks like it only works in shell and valero gas stations now but since i've been using it it knows my profile so i'll say claim offer because i pulled in here to get some gas and then it says you have um up until you know three hours to go get the gas from this location which i'm already hearing is done well it tells me now to upload my receipt which i just got from the gas station machine and you just take a picture of your receipt try to fit the whole thing in there now sometimes it'll actually remember me so it'll say did you use card ending in x y and z at this pump and you can just say yes you won't have to take a, you won't have to take a picture of the receipt and I guess it'll scan the uh, service station's records, find your transaction, and you are good to go. So uh, let's go ahead and say attach receipt. It's uploading it. Also, Wendy's, you can get, um, actually I might go there since I was thinking about getting some food today. You know what? Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go to Wendy's and get some food. Claim, and you get 15% back. Heads up, this offer is not at your current location okay so i gotta drive to wendy's to get this offer and i'll upload the receipt once it's done but um so yeah the, this one here is up at the top saying my receipt has been submitted within two to four days uh they'll let me know what's up and that's cool so we're gonna go actually head over to wendy's and um get 15 percent cash back at that location nice well i guess that whole eating healthy thing kind of went out the window but eat healthy in the morning and i'm gonna have like whatever i want i guess in the afternoon it's a process guys it's a process i did go to the gym today for the first time in a long time so i feel good about that so i can outweigh uh what i'm so i can outweigh what i'm eating i guess when i'm burning it off at the gym another thing i was excited about to do this drive for today as well is i just switched over carriers i've been with at&t for as long as i can humanly remember and they've always had good service i never had a problem with them it's just you know it's kind of expensive and compared to this new phone plans carrier that came out called wing i don't know if you guys heard about it but they had a promotion during um the holidays it's a uh, 49 dollars for unlimited data talk text and all that kind of stuff and a hot spot which i like to use when i'm just kind of driving around i'm always trying to drive around and find like a good wi-fi zone i don't have to do that anymore i can park my car get on my phone handle what i need to do and hopefully conserve gas because i'll already be with the hot spot so yeah it's only 49 dollars. they use the at&t sprints tower so you pretty much are still with those carriers it still says at&t at the top of my phone but i'm just paying a lot less so so far it's been really good i've been using my hot spot um uh, uber sent me my first order with no problem and um so we'll just check it out throughout the day and see how it goes all right we're fed and now we're going back online let's rock it was three o'clock and my second order just came in at wow <laughs> let's go ahead and get this delivery started i said it once and i will say it again it is a great idea to bring something with you to do because you don't know what these wait times are gonna be like. Like if I didn't have anything to do, I would've just been kinda just sitting here. And I'm glad now I got this unlimited data because I was able to get on my phone, download some stuff from the cloud, edit some videos. And uh, as soon as I was getting into the thick of it, an order came, but hey, it's cool. At least it killed some time. I didn't even know how long I was uh, offline doing that. But we got order. Let's go get some money. Hello, how are you? Pretty good. Got to pick up, drop a for order for Jenny. Yeah, she's in here. Do you need anything else? No, that's everything. All right, I'll give it to her. Thank you, guys. Okay, so we dropped that one off at the front office. Mark that one as delivered. Whoa. 
order three just came in looks like we're heading to mcdonald's on william cannon let's see while we're at this light what did these people order Woo! three double cheeseburgers make chicken made nuggets are always freaking popular fancy i was like i don't see you drinking here that'd be very odd okay we're moving <laughs> Just pick up that food from McDonald's. Man, you gotta love that communication. Go to the drive-thru. Like, hey, I'm here to pick up an order for Dustin on Uber Eats. All right, pull to the second window. Go around to the second window. Girl opens the door, the window. She's like, can I help you, sir? <laughs> I'm like, whoa, I'm here to pick up the order for Uber Eats. What's the code? I'm like, <laughs> didn't the last guy tell you I was here to pick up some food? I would have thought the last guy would have told you I was here to pick up some food. But what do I know? Yeah, for Uber? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Head to your drop at the Bell Austin Southwest Apartments. I've done four trips today, guys. How much money do you think I've gathered so far? Let's play a little game. Have I gotten around $14? $16? Or have we reached twenty dollars? Let's see. I'll give you some time. Let's look. For two hours, four trips, I have made fourteen dollars. What's up, guys? So, around three to five, uh, three to four, I kind of got like dead, dead. I'm talking like graveyard dead so i went ahead and realized i wasn't too far from home so i actually went ahead and went home and um, started working on some stuff some personal stuff so about five o'clock is when the larger boosters are going to start and then six o'clock we have that promo where every three orders you do you get an extra six dollars so i'm gonna head back out um around those times and we'll finish this out round two Fight. I am back in my car. I'm about to go head into a multiplier zone that's worth a little bit more because in this area that I am in right now, there's no multipliers, which I don't get. It's almost six and I really want those multipliers. Honestly, I just really want some orders. Dude, what is going on? It is 632. I mean, and I've gotten no orders. I'm sitting in this parking lot. I mean, I'm working on a few things myself, like you know on my social media like i keep saying but i didn't come out here to sit in the parking lot to work on my social media i came out here to like make some money i can't believe it like it's really really slow and all those promos like all those uh quest promotions what they're called i don't know if i'm gonna get any this is bogus so totally bogus What's up, people? <laughs> As you can see, it's a brand new day, and you're probably like, what happened to yesterday? What happened to like all the, the orders and the trips that you normally do in a day? There was no yesterday. <laughs> there was no yesterday. Um, it, was, it was dead. Dead, dead. Dead, 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 dead. <laughs> so I just, I just went home. Um, I actually just got in my car in, uh, at my apartment right now. I'm about to go get some food. On my way home yesterday, I was stopping at a restaurant and ordered some food. And when I got home, they completely gave me the wrong order. I don't know whose order it was. The food was great, though. <laughs> Not something I normally would order, but um, it wasn't what I was you know, craving last night. I, it was too far to go back. She's like, you mind driving back over here and uh, I'll take care of it for you? I was like, I'm home. I'm out of my street clothes. Like, I'm not driving back there. She's like, well, if you come back tomorrow, I'll... You know, we can make it right. I was like, you know, I'll actually take you up on that offer because I'm going to be hungry tomorrow and I'm going to need some food to eat. So I'm about to drive over there. I'm not going to say the name of the restaurant. I'm not trying to slander them. People make mistakes. But um, I'm going to drive back over there and get my food and we'll hopefully have some orders today. I'm going to put some uh, things up on the screen here. As you can see in the Facebook groups, everybody yesterday was suffering. Like there was no orders and the ones that came in were few and far between some people went out of their zones some people went out of their cities uh to even make a couple of dollars even multi-apping was not happening <laughs> so um yeah let's hope today is better i sent a lot of affirmations out yesterday i've noticed too with that 
it might not always come right when you want it, but it'll come when you need it. You know what I'm saying? So throughout the week, let's hope some of those affirmations that I sent out to the universe come back to me because yesterday sucked. It sucked. <laughs> I'm going to turn on my app here and we'll see what uh, wacky adventures we get into today. I would love to get into something because yesterday I got into nothing. <laughs> so this is funny. I go into my notification screen and I get this. How satisfied are you with delivering for Uber? I'm not going to answer that right now because if I compare it to yesterday, you're not going to like what I send you, Uber. So we're just going to ignore that and we're going to go online. Okay. Okay. So after a long hour, maybe even longer than that, of sitting here in this parking lot, an uh, order finally came in. Looks like it's a Jack in the Box. And I'm actually going to go ahead over there to get it right now. Hopefully, this is the start of something great. Hopefully. Hi. Hello. Got a pickup order. For Jesus? Uh, yeah, I'm checking real quick. Yep, that's him. Have a great day. Thank you so much. All I can say is thank you, Jesus, for being hungry. Because you're my first order for the day. Let's hopefully make you the last. All right, $3 in the bank. Jose has his food. Now, we're just waiting for our next set of orders. Oh, one thing we didn't look at today is the zones. So it's about 2.15, and this is when the zones actually start to become active. I'm in the one multiplier. Actually, might move until at least a two. You know what? Actually, not even worth it. Everywhere else is about one to two. I'm sure I'll be driving around mostly anyway. But later today, click on Dying Face. Uh, earnings, promotions. I went ahead and added these to my day anyway. Five o'clock is when things are really going to start to get spicy. Let's get in here. Or not. There we go. That's when we start getting the big mucheladas. Three, four, seven. Awesome. Seven and five. So yeah. Um, this is a great map, but if you have no orders, you make no money. So let's hopefully get some orders today. You know what that sound means. We got another order coming in. Actually, and that one's just right over there too. Let's go get it. Pick up order for Marquis under Uber. Yeah. Uh, chicken pie with extra noodle and extra chicken. That's it. Thank you much. Uh -huh, thank you. Have a good one. You too. Take care. Not to jinx anything, I'm feeling a little bit better about today. Let's go ahead and get Marquis his food. Turn right onto Pinehurst Drive, then turn left onto Pebble Beach Drive. So Marcus met me. We got his food. We're back on. on Coral Ridge Circle Tour, Pebble Beach Drive. No, no, no. That's dropped off. <laughs> Listen to me, robot. <laughs> Three dollars. Ready for the next order. This neighborhood has its own little pond. It's really nice. Duckies and swans. Double days. I was actually driving over into this area to park and this order came in. Let's go get it. So this is interesting. I'm at the gate. I actually have the gate code, but uh, do I get out and just go punch it in front of this guy? No, I definitely don't call it out in front of this guy. Oh, I guess we just wait. It appears that he was a fellow delivery driver, so I got out and just punched the code into the box. You know, put my little shoulder in the way so you couldn't see it. I don't want people's code out like that. Anywho, that one is marked off and delivered. We're at $6 right now, guys. Only a few trips, and they've all been pretty short. But um, I'm just happy some orders are coming in. Thank God I brought some stuff to do. It was another long set 
of time in between orders but i guess got an order from jack in the box which is actually right behind me i parked over in this parking lot so i'm gonna run over there and get this food and drop it off to the customer hopefully we start picking up and getting some back-to-back -back orders it is 408 facebook group is saying the same thing it's still kind of slow but um people's now just probably getting out of work so probably about five or six they should be home and they should be hungry like this so i'm gonna fold this down to make it look a little less exposed <laughs> see much better okay let's get on the road <laughs> Okay, I just dropped it off at the Ultra Beauty place. It smelled great in there. And we're waiting for some more orders. Again, that's not the money I've made. That's just my Uber points. All right, I was sitting here playing around on the phone and look what came in. Pizza time. Trisha? Trisha? Trisha, right? Trisha, yeah. Cool. The marinara sauce is right up top, okay? Thank you, man. Thank you, sir. I knew this was coming. Alrighty, so that one is delivered. Come on now. Don't stop. Bring them on those orders. Looks like we got two tips in so far. That's good. Something's better than nothing. Just pulled up to the gas station to get some snacks. What in God's name is this right here? Y'all remember this? Probably not. All right, we got another order. We've been here for quite a minute. Popeye's chicken. Let me go and grab it before I lose it. Okay, let's move. Uh oh, just about to turn my car on and we got a double. Here we go. Not gonna lie, I got a little confused, but I figured it out. Let's go ahead and get both of these orders. Delivered. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Delivered. There we go. That one was wild. <laughs> uh, dropping off the uh, things to the customers and my GPS wasn't like keeping up with me and it was like all over the place. Needless to say, um, it was an adventure. But we got both of them delivered. I'll take it. All right, so I was driving and I guess I didn't see the alert. Johnny Carino's popped up on my screen and by the time I got to hit it, it was like, uh, no you don't, it was gone. But guess what? Awesome Pizza popped in right after it, so uh, I'm heading there right now. Looks like <sighs> we're back on track. Can you say delivered? Nice. Well, that was interesting. I just picked up over here at Green Mesquite, you know, like Uber Eats, here to pick up for, who is this, Jeremy. Give me the food, I'm walking out to my car. Guy follows me out, hands in the pocket, all kind of like, oh, hey guy, uh, yeah. <laughs> you haven't paid yet. And I was like, it's Uber Eats, it's already paid for. He's like, oh, okay, good. You think you would know that before you give me the food? Like, know your system? Anyway, moving on, because Jeremy's food, I don't want it to get cold. Such strange human beings. Head to your drop if at 7500 SIH 35 Frontage Road. So we will. Mr. Jeremy was outside to get his BBQ. So I'm talking about. I'll take it. <clears throat> so we've been in um, jump zones. I'm going to try to get to uh, seven multiplier zone because tonight seems to be hitting a little bit harder than yesterday. Dang, those lights are bright, dude. Turn that mess off. Just came in. Gotta figure out how to get all the way over to the left. Do some kind of crazy Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift maneuver. I'll make it. Oh, here we 
Yep. I'm gonna read the directions. Thank you. Thank you. One boy was standing right outside his apartment complex door, ready to get his food. That was cool. Like walked right into like the little security gates and he was like, bah, right there. So let's go ahead and get his food delivered and see what else we got. Or should I say, mark his food as delivered. There we go. Six sixteen. Thank you, though. Jonathan. Hey, this is Uber. I can't seem to find your address. I see six six uh, six seventeen eighteen, but I'm gonna see six sixteen. Uh, I am on the ground level. 618 and 620. Ah, okay, I'll be there in a few. Thanks. Uh, people in apartment complexes, please, please, please help us out. I go deliver this pizza to the guy just now. On the outside of the building, okay, his apartment is. 1616. 16. I'm delivering on the outside. I see 1618. 16, I see 1619, 16, 1617. 16, I'm like, okay, cool. It's got to be around here somewhere. And there's two floors on the outside. There's stairs on the outside. So I look up the stairs 1619 upstairs, 1620 above 1617. I'm like, where is 1616? 16? So I'm walking around, go like through the middle. And on the middle, bottom floor where I am right now, everything's like 601, 608. I'm like, where is 616? So I call him, like, hey, dude, like, I see 618, 617, 620. Like, where's 616? You would think it would be in this group. You would think 620 wouldn't be there and 616 would be there, right? Like, oh, no, you got to come through the middle part where you'll see, like, three rows of stairs and go up the stairs, and that's where you'll see 616. Why? <laughs> Why? You know, it's just apartment complexes. What can you do? At least it's busy tonight. That's a good thing. See, this is how you do building numbers. Look at that. Nice, bright, bat signal. Jordan. It was really slow for a moment. A moment, but Taiwanese, you always saving my life. Appreciate that. And I'm actually in the parking lot, not too far from it. Let's go get it. It's been a very busy night, and it's brought me to downtown. Food trailer, going to pick up some food right now. I had to rush back to my car before it got towed. I had to park in the alleyway just to get to this freaking restaurant. Oh, madness, that's what happens when you work downtown. All right, here you go, my friend. Thank you, guys. Slices are in the box on top, and the bottom has a regular pie. Perfect, thank you. All I can say is tonight really picked up. I actually got to talk to some other uh, drivers while we were waiting for it at this sushi place. Another guy, he did Uber, and the other guy was first day doing favor. So uh, you meet some pretty interesting people out. Enough about that. Let's go give John his pizza. Oh, man, normally I don't let orders get to me, but that last order with this pizza, pretty upset. I'm walking around the dude's complex. Another one of those complexes where it's door one, two, four five his building or his his door is um 103 i'm like hey i got i'm out here trying to find your door uh we're missing 103 uh it's somewhere by some potted plants the best i can tell you no clear directions i'm walking up and down this building around it i'm like dude your pizza is getting cold like where can i meet you like come get the food <laughs> you know not giving me any kind of direction so i walk around walk around finally turn this obscure block uh, a curb or a corner you can see i'm like all flustered and he and there he is i'm like oh okay here we are oh thank you thank you and i was like oh, thank you <laughs> for helping me none anyway i'll have to remember hard to find <laughs> delivered maybe it was just me but dude give me a freaking break kit kat bar <sighs> yeah that one 
that one is sending me home. Like, I really want to do a few more orders, but, like, after that one, I'm kind of like, dude, I'm done. I'm, you know, I'm like, I'm over here by buildings. I'm over here by doors one, 102 and 101. Where are you, where's your 103? Why am I running up on 104 right now and not seeing you? As if you peek your head outside, you actually should be able to hear me and be able to meet me to come get your food while it's hot before it gets cold. As you can see, I'm back home. I was gonna do another trip, but my coin said just go home. <laughs> it's almost, it's like 12.09 right now. So, I mean, honestly, I could have actually just driven for the rest of the night and maybe like came home at three. Cause I, I was on a roll and the orders were coming in, but that last pizza order, dude, it just kind of threw my energy all off. And I didn't want to take that to another customer. So I'm gonna come home, go ahead and get some sleep. I'm probably gonna drive in the afternoon tomorrow because in the morning I actually have somewhere to be. But it's just like, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry guys. <laughs> I didn't want this to end up to be in a rant video toward the end because today was actually pretty awesome. Like Uber redeemed themselves because um, yesterday was <laughs> But uh, enough about all that. High hope, spirits, we actually made some money today. I probably could have made a lot more if I stayed out there, but this is where we ended. Let's find out what we made uh, today, and I'll actually show you guys what I made yesterday in that disaster. <laughs> Here we are, the all-seen screen of Uber Truth. So what did we make today? Nice. 135.17. And I actually did 20 trips. That's actually a lot of trips to make this. I think last time I did, what, 17 trips? maybe and made like 140 uh let's check into this real quick and then we're gonna see what we made yesterday as you can see yesterday is way down here yeah so for the week i'm at 158 so not too bad not too bad yeah 20 trips online for 10 hours that's a little skewed because there was a lot of time in between where i was doing nothing so we're not gonna really pay attention to that so for the most part thank you guys everybody pretty much chip this person didn't that person didn't and then these last two and then mr pizza guy but um yeah either one of those two people tip at the end then i will definitely be up to hopefully 140 that's amazing appreciate it even you pizza guy your money adds to this so i can't be too mad yesterday a whomping 23 dollars. that is sad for I'll be online for four hours, only $23. Yesterday was really, really slow. But hey, it's $23 more than I had when I first started, right? So we have the rest of the week to redeem ourselves to make sure we reach um, my goal. I like to try to get at least five to $600 a week um, to have living expenses paid for. But uh, yeah, today was actually pretty successful. I'm confident that a few more tips might come in before the night's over, we'll see. And then maybe that 135 will actually be somewhere in the 140s. So literally, as I'm signing off from you guys to say goodnight, an $8 tip comes in. I don't know if you can see it. An $8 tip comes in. So my total right now is 143.31. And if Pizza Man happens to tip me, I'll be even higher in the 40s, closer to the 50s. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow. Just so you guys can see that clearly. Yeah. 143. It came in right there. $8 tip. Blessings. Blessing, blessing, blessings. So as for now, I'm gonna go power down and get ready to get some sleep. I really hope you guys enjoyed this two day video of me riding around town and doing Uber Eats. I wish the other day was a little bit more exciting, but there wasn't a lot going on. So it wasn't really much to show. Today was so busy. Like I didn't have time to really film everything that was happening. I just had to get to these orders. Hopefully tomorrow we'll actually have a little bit more footage to show and I'll bring you guys a new video. So if you like these videos, you gotta hit the like button. And if you wanna see more videos, you gotta hit the subscribe button. As I said, I probably won't be posting the links that often anymore in the um, Facebook chat room because I didn't wanna be spamming the group. So you gotta hit the notification bell next to the subscription button. So YouTube will say, hey, 
This guy got a new video out. I really appreciate everybody's watching and everybody's support and their comments. And I will see you on the next ride. Good night.